Lama 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 TV. Hi, Opar. How are you guys? Good, man. Kind of sleepy. Yeah. But yeah. all good. Yeah. Sleepy, all good. Sun's starting to come out. Yeah. Should be a good day. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I hope so. <laughs> How does it feel to be finally able to present uh, your last album, 27 Miles, to finally to the world? Really, like, so good. Yeah, yeah. it's just, like, it's crazy. Like, uh, yeah, just really fucking good. Like, yeah. yeah, yeah. Some, sometimes when we're playing the songs on this run, I keep thinking, like, yo, we've been playing these songs for years. Yeah. And now I remember that we haven't played these songs to people. Yeah. We've just been playing them for years. Yeah, so. Yeah, so. so it's nice that we've been, we must have been playing these songs since like 2019. Yeah. So yeah, like it's great to finally be able to play them. Like, yeah, yeah, like see the crowd reaction and be like, oh, sick. Like, you know, like people singing along. And yeah. Stuff. Yeah. Because all through the pandemic, have people been like, yo, this album is like my favorite album and like this. And then you're like, oh, cool. And then you get to see it live and you're like, Oh, oh shit. people are, yeah, 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 people yeah. actually like it. Like, yeah, you got two years to listen to it yeah. uh, in your yeah. room. and. <laughs> That's your first album under a major label, so uh, Roadrunner. And um, do you feel it changed something about your, your vision of the band now? Or? No, not really. I think it just taught us a different work ethic in a way. You know, yeah. just just showed us like, you know, like we, we come from like a DIY place, and then it just get showed us like a different way to work. And like, you know, like we learned a lot from working with a bigger producer and having a bit more money to be like more time and yeah. more time to figure things out. That's it really, yeah. It didn't, I don't think it changed much apart from just showing us a different different way how things work. Yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah we're forever just freestyling. So yeah. <laughs> yeah. we just make it up as we go along. And then for the next album, it doesn't change anything for you. It's just like the same thing. Yeah, before. just trying to get, yeah. just trying to make a better album than the last one. Really. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. Just five minutes playing some music together. Yeah. yeah. With bands like Turnstile going massive this last year, do you feel it opened the door for bands like Iopar? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like that. I mean, that can never harm. Uh, it, it, it's great. I mean, Turnstile are amazing. So yeah. I think like just to see what they've done. Do you feel there's something that changed the two, three last years? Uh, changed within uh, more so. more shows, more opportunities? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Not not necessarily for higher power, but for just like hardcore in general. Yeah. Like it seems, it definitely seems a lot bigger, especially on like the West Coast of America. Yeah. It seems huge there. All the shows seem massive just for like, like we're on tour with Drain, but the videos you see of Drain back home yeah. playing oh. is huge for a hardcore band to have that. Yeah, like, they so. their regular shows are like festivals. Yeah. So, so like it's yeah, I feel like it's definitely changed over the past few years, hasn't yeah. it? Like, What's the saying? High tide raises all ships. Yeah, so, yeah. High tide um, raises all yeah, ships. Yeah, let's well, go. From the European <laughs> side, we feel like uh, in the UK it's going bigger and bigger uh, since two or three years. I don't yeah. know. How oh, you feel defi it, but... Yeah, definitely. And like I said, I don't know if it's just people who have had like no shows for ages like maybe it'll die off who knows like yeah. but yeah. people seem hungry for it for sure yeah. so yeah. it's only a good thing isn't it so. how do you write your song i don't know if you feel like you write lyrics and vocal line first or do you how do you do the manager yeah i write my lyrics like in i have just like in my phone in my notes i just write down like yeah. uh just like basically my thoughts you know what I mean? Like stream of consciousness. And then when we do have a song and I have the melodies, I fit the words to that really. Like I don't write anything specifically for something. You know what I mean? We'll write a song and then I'll have a melody and I'll be like, okay, what fits this melody? So like you know? there is music on the side yeah, and yeah. then you are some lyrics yeah. and you... Yeah, pretty much, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah work yeah. them out together. Yeah. So Teamwork. Yeah. Um, I saw last week that uh, Anthony from Vane and Holly from Static to Dress yeah. <laughs> did it in uh, uh, the Dunlut Festival. Uh, what, what happened? Yeah. I just had tonsillitis, dude. I just, yeah, just yeah. had really bad tonsillitis. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, stuck in bed, couldn't get out. So. Yeah, and we, we hit up by Anthony. Anthony was over just before the vet, our, t our tour started. So we hit up Anthony, he was super down to help out. And Ollie, and this was all within like 12 hours notice. Yeah, yeah. Um, and they actually made it a great day, still. Like, it was it's definitely an unforgettable set as well. Like, feel like anyone that saw that, like, yeah, it's cool. They're, yeah. they're like, they're our family, so like, it's so cool to, to show yeah. that some bands just like, yeah, no problem. 
we fill in. Uh, yeah, we won't let anything stop us. Yeah. <laughs> we won't let anything yeah, stop us. Yeah, I was like us. saying, I was like, it's probably kind of cooler that they're doing it. Yeah, like, yeah, you know, everyone's seen High Power with me a bunch of times. I was like, they get to yeah. see High Power with Vayne and Static Dress the ones. So. Yeah, it's just like, and we're all like family, so it's just, it makes sense. I'd yeah. like, I wouldn't want to do it with anyone else. Like, yeah. <laughs> thank you so much, guys. No, no, no thank you. That's very really cool. Wow, 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 attends, avant de partir, n'oublie pas de mettre un petit like et euh, le follow. Parce que l'air de rien, euh, c'est le seul moyen de me montrer que t'as bien aimé. Parce que sinon, euh, je le sais pas. Et, euh, et voilà. Bye